name is Daria Sanetra. I travel the world to taste the highest quality fruit, veggies, herbs, nuts and seeds. Recently, just before the outbreak of the pandemic, I, together with my partner, traveled to Pakistan and we got stuck. And today, we'd like to share our story with you. 13th of March 2020. We left out of Spain, which we have made our home and landed in Islamabad, the capital of Pakistan. Welcome to Pakistan, the land of the pure. So this is Islamabad airport. I'm just traveling from Islamabad to Gilgit and I'll be taking a domestic flight. Ladies and gentlemen, Captain Raja Amir welcome you on board flight PG606. On the left you can see Nana Parbat. We arrived in Gilgit, Baltistan. Everybody at the airport was wearing masks and gloves. Our temperature was taken and we had to fill in a foreigner's questionnaire to determine if we had any symptoms. But finally, we were allowed out of the airport to continue our holiday. We are still speechless and felt like all the adjectives and superlatives of all the languages of the world put together couldn't express the tangible and intangible beauty and charm of this very precious place on earth. Simply enchanted with Gilgit's raw nature and mesmerizing simplicity and abundance. All coming through so naturally and making us most welcome indeed. And as there is no love sincerer than the love of food, I found a home in Gilgit. Away from home, I found Mantu, the so famous dumplings of Gilgit. A dish so close to my heart, as we have the traditional Polish version called pierogi. Here was the moment of celebration, of love for Gilgit. As the way to Darius' heart, is through her stomach. So here we are in North of Pakistan admiring what was happening many many years ago. So here it is, Old Silk Road, which can be viewed all there, hiding in the mountain. And this is how people used to travel to transport goods, which is just pretty insane. <laughs> We were on the mission to buy the best quality apricots. Well, I'm buying some uh, local produce of this area that I'm in now, which is Gilgit. And uh, what they grow here, it's a local um, apricots. And so these are fully organic apricots, which I'm, I've got a pleasure to buy now. But these are nuts of apricots, which I've never these. tried. This is nuts. nuts. We have the oil of apricot, which is something that I'm really excited to try it. Unfortunately, the road to Hansa Valley was closed to non-Hansa residents. To the many attractions like Atabat Lake, our dream to see, the forts, etc. Very sad for us. We spent a few more days in Gilgit walking around, exploring, finding Give more friendly, helpful, curious, smile. warm, Come on, open, give me a smile. <laughs> shy, happy. 24th of March 2020, we flew back to Islamabad and spent a week on lockdown. Well, we were still free to walk around to shops and parks for exercise, but the everyday conveniences and norms of life were not available to us. With many places closed, many landmarks out of bounds, and so we were pretty much locked down in our guest house. So, to conclude my beginning to this video and the question, is Pakistan a land of the pure? In my opinion, a big yes. 